Cert Manager is a Kubernetes add-on that one can use to generate and manage SSL certificates within the Kubernetes cluster. There are standard issuers or the certificate authorities, CA, that the Cert Manager leverage to generate or renew the TLS certificates. But, how about using our own CA or self-signed issuer to create and manage free certificates? That's exactly what we are going to evaluate today. Let us start the project by creating a VM first. I want to keep everything as code, therefore I'm going to use Vagrant as the infrastructure orchestrator with Hyper-V as the provider. The machine is ready for use. Our first task is to install the Kubernetes cluster on this new VM. We will use K3S, as it's simple and also lightweight and easy to set up. Next, install other components such as Helm, JQ, Firefox, etc. that we will be using later. We will use Keycloak as the demo application for this video. Let's install Keycloak from the source. The default values can be edited to add the initial user detail that will be created as part of the installation. Before installing Cert Manager, let us understand few terminologies and functionality of its components. A Cert Manager has three components, an issuer, a certificate and a secret. An issuer is responsible for signing the certificates that are created by the Cert Manager. We need to create a cluster-wide issuer, which is in our case will be a self-signed issuer. We will then create a local issuer, that is namespace scope which will then be responsible for signing other certs that are generated within the specific namespace. A certificate is a custom CRD that will create TLS key pair in the form Kubernetes secrets. The TLS secrets can then be used in gateways such as ingress or a load balancer. To summarize, we will create these Kubernetes objects for our demonstration, a cluster-wide issuer, a local issuer and a certificate for keycloak and an ingress. So let us begin with creating a manifest for issuer. Then, a certificate with local issuer for Keycloak. Finally, an ingress for external access leveraging the Cert Manager generated TLS secret. Install the Cert Manager using Helm or Kubiktal.
apply the manifests which we created. issuer is not in ready state because the root CA is currently available in the default namespace only. In order to copy the root CA secret across all the namespace, we will use a Kubernetes add-on called Reflector. Install the Reflector from source. Edit the root secret to include the reflector annotations. Delete and recreate the local issuer to verify the state turning out to ready. Since we do not have a real DNS, we will add a host's entry to mimic a fully qualified domain name. The remote display need to be exported to host IP to forward the X server traffic. As we can see, the auto-generated self-signed TLS certificate has been picked up correctly, but the CA is not yet verifiable. To fix this, we will import the Cert Manager generated root CA into the browser trust store.
Finally, our Keycloak is completely secured to use auto self-signed certificate from the CERT manager. That's it for this video, and thanks for watching.